welcome back to another video. We just got some decals in for our YouTube channel and, and our Instagram. Let me show them to you right now. So we got these. They look pretty nice, don't they? Nick Jensen, check him out. He has some good decals. He has his own little company there as a business card. We're gonna be putting this on the back of the car and we need to clean the area. As you can tell, this car's pretty dirty already. So we're going to be cleaning the entire thing. Then we can plop these on in the back. Let me show you where we're gonna put them on. We got two stickers, one for our Instagram and one for our YouTube. And we're gonna be putting one in right here and then the other one in on the other side. We don't know which one's gonna go where. I guess we're gonna decide that soon enough. Yeah, so let's get this car cleaned. So we prematurely kind of uh, put some water on the louvers, but we also wanted to test out how these would hold up with the pressure washer. I'm gonna spray it first at a normal distance, then I'm gonna spray it at a pretty close distance and see what happens. I'm thinking nothing's gonna happen, but we can f find out. All right, so this is gonna be a test from a normal distance. They seem to be on there, so that's a good sign. Let's try putting the nozzle a little closer and see what happens, I guess. Hopefully they don't come off, because if they do, that would, that would be good. They're still on, that's a good sign. Uh, I got some water on my face, but you know, that's all good. Well, they held up, and that's a good thing. It's a thumbs up for me. We, we washed the car. The back's all dry, so we can put these stickers on, but we still have to dry out the front and everything. As you can see, there's water still all over the place. But the sun's going down, we have to get this on. No instructions with this, so. But I have put some decals on before, so I think I know how this works. So we take the back off first. It's coming off pretty well. So you know it's quality. So we got this off. Just kind of have to plop it on there. See what happens. It's on there now. Too late to make any changes. So now I think we're supposed to peel the plastic. Perfect. It's even better than the uh, Brembo decal. It's not peeling off or anything. There you go guys. We're gonna put the other one on really quick and show you guys what the final product looks like. It looks really nice. There's uh, just a couple air bubbles which we can take out. But I'm really happy with the end product. It's a little big, which like, it's kind of our fault. We didn't really properly sized it. We were in kind of a rush. Let's take a look at the other side now. So this side obviously came out just like the other side. Very nice. I don't think there's any air bubbles in this one. So for the bonus, we got this uh, little Sharpie. We got this oil-based Sharpie right here. We're gonna see how it looks when we white out the Pirellis on the tire. I'm not sure how it's gonna look. Yeah, I don't know how it's gonna look, so we're just gonna do one tire, I guess, and see how it looks. If we don't like it, then we're gonna take it off. It's oil-based. It should come off. Hopefully it does come off if we don't like it. So yeah, let's get this thing rolling and go ahead and apply the Sharpie. Here goes nothing. Day two. So before we actually wash the car, let's take a look at the tire letters real quick because uh, we want to do a little something special for this video. Not really special, but uh, do a little some do do a little bit of an experiment. Let's we can call it, I guess. So let's take a look at them before we actually do whatever we're about to do. This side looks pretty good. I don't notice too many chips actually because like some some of the other sides have a little bit of chipping. It's actually pretty good. These these things are holding up pretty well. They look like they're in pretty good condition right now. So let's get on with our experiment. <laughs> I got a pressure washer right here. We're gonna use this to basically simulate a wash. So what we're gonna do is pretty much spray it like we normally would at a normal distance, I guess. And then we're gonna try to go up close and see what happens when you go really up close. Maybe it'll chip off, maybe it'll stay. Uh, we're gonna find out. All right, so let's start with the normal distance and uh, see, see how it holds up. bad at all actually. They actually held up really well. I'm actually really surprised at how good they held up. I, I thought honestly it would probably chip off but that was a normal distance so let's try a closer distance and uh, see what happens. Okay so this is gonna be pretty close with a 25 degree pressure washer nozzle. Let's see what happens. Wow, that actually held up really well. I'm really surprised at how good they, uh, this, t this paint pretty much holds up. It is Sharpie. It's kind of coming off, but like, it's still on there pretty well. It's definitely covering the whole Pirelli, so I'm very surprised. I actually, that's really nice, so we'd have to be redoing the tire letters over and over again each time we wash the car. It's a thumbs up for me. Day three. So it's another day and we just wanted to give you a little update on how the decals look in the back because you guys saw them at night. You weren't able to see both of them at once so you weren't really able to see the big picture. So let's take a look. Oh, there are those decals. They're a little big but uh, they're 
they're not too big, so I guess it's fine. We haven't had any followers since we put them on. It's been it's been like what three or four days. Maybe like when they're driving, they don't want to get to, get on their phones. But I've seen a ton of people do that too, so I'm not sure. So you made it to the end of another video. Uh, make sure you are subscribed because we have some cool ideas coming up. We got a short film that we're that we should have already been working on, but we didn't really work on. We'll see when that comes out. That's probably gonna take a little while to come out. So make sure you are subscribed for that. If you like the video, make sure you hit that like button, hit the notification bell, comment down below on stuff we can improve on and some ideas you. You guys might have for future videos. Thanks for watching.